Hey y'all, out here at the uh, Pigeon Forge Rod Run and I've got a really nice Pro Touring 69 Camaro. Um, the owner Todd is uh, actually follows my channel and uh, when I came to the Rod Run I was checking out his car, he knew who I was and I'd always think it's cool when, when the people that follow me on my channel I get to shoot their cars and see their hot rods because a lot of my subscribers got some pretty cool cars and this is no exception. So let me run them down and uh, we'll take a look at it. Todd, how are you brother? Good, how you doing today, Scott? Not too bad. Tell me a little bit about this hot rod. Uh, been working on it about two years. Uh, trying to get it together. Got a, uh, did an LS swap in it, LS1, the 4L60E. Uh, Detroit mini tubs, TCI, four length suspension. Did you do the work yourself? Yes, sir. Is those original seats in there? That is uh, O2 Camara. Okay. Seats. But then you just did something different there. You got the houndstooth in yes, there, but then the... it's wrapped in the leather, which right. is a little different. Right. No, I like that, man. And I've commented on the uh, the council, but you said that that is uh, a part you can buy. You can buy that, yeah. Where's that from? I got pretty much the complete interior I've got from uh, Camara Central. All right. From Sean. So you can get all this stuff yep. from Camara Central. Well, I love those gauges. Where are those from? That is uh, the VHX gauges, digital. Right. Pretty That's Dakota awesome. Digital? Mm hmm But I like that carbon fiber back yeah, and all that. We did that in the... That's uh, hydrographics. I do that. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you're one of my new best friends. Yeah. Yeah, no, Todd can do uh, hydro forming. What's it called? It's hydrographics. Hydro hydrographics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. water transfer. Right. Paint. Transferring the paint from the water to the to Where'd the you do that at? You did something in carbon fiber around this, right? I did uh, quite a few pieces. Is it under the hood? Uh, the, in the trunk. Oh, I knew there was somewhere I asked you about, and that's how I even figured out you did that. Yeah. And what's the name of that company? How can people get in touch with you if they want that done? Uh, I can give you know, get a cell phone. Uh, call me on a cell phone. Oh, or, that's right. You know, what number you want them to call you at? 601 590 Two two four two. Get me on that pretty much any time, and if somebody ships something to me to to dip. You know, we right. send it back to them. Right. Ship it back to them. Oh, that's how it works, right? Um, I did quite a few parts on the inside of the car, around the shifter. Stuff we'll get like around it. We'll do it. They pull out that build book for a minute. Let's see how this thing started. What condition was it in when it got started? Well, I've got pretty much. I've got the pieces of it when it was. Uh, yeah, those are all new body after, panels. Yeah, after yeah, panels yeah, have yeah, been yeah, changed. Yeah, yeah. This is, you know, at my shop where we pretty much it's, uh, I mean, it could go on and on. Yeah, 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 no, I understand. Well, it looks like, it looks like you just bought the panels and welded them together. I'll be the straight with you. Bought, yeah, pretty much out of a book. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and you did all that work yourself? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man. Oh, that's nice. All right, I see what you did now. You yeah, this are. is Detroit uh, mini uh, mini tubs that we that I put in it to get the 20 by 12s under. Right. And that's you'd have to do that to get them. You know. That's what it takes, isn't it? Yeah, that's what it takes to get them to fit. But that's what you need. You got 18s on so the front. It's uh, 19s. 19s on the front. On the front. Yeah. And what's the color? It is a uh, toxic orange off of a 2010 Charger. Okay. So I hate to say that. Yeah, it's Mopar you know, Yeah, yeah Mopar. We'll blow right by <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah, blow right by that. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, that's what it is. But oh, this man. is pretty much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One yeah. time it was put together and it was taken apart. You got any cool. shots underneath the car? Uh, I'm guessing you know, that's as nice as the rest I've, of it. I've got some with the, you know, the exhaust and, and all done. Right. But we was rushing to get here to this to right. this show. I didn't really get a chance to put all that. I mean, we was running up to the night before. Trying to get so this is a fresh build. It's fresh, yeah. No kidding. Yeah, yeah no. Wow. It's fresh. Let's look under the hood. That's no different than anybody else. What was funny was I was in Detroit this year at Autorama, and when you would step into Joe Lewis, Cobo Hall, it smelled like a paint booth because yeah. all the fresh builds sitting down in the basement and all them solvents coming up, you know? Wow, that's cool, man. I love those valve covers. Well, they're not called valve covers now. What do they call those things? Pretty much, that's covers. Covers, yeah. yeah. Is that hydro 
done too. No, no, that, that's just painted. The, you painted that. Yeah, painted yeah. a bit of the, even the, the white on it's painted and cleared, you know. Man. Wow. Have you dined on it? I haven't. No? No, not, not yet. We, uh, I'd like to do that sometime in the future. Yeah, I'm like with you. That done. Man, you did a nice this job, brother. pretty much the first show that this, this car has been to. Right. You, know? you can keep tweaking on it. Oh yeah, you never yeah, get yeah, done yeah. with them. Never get done with them. They say when you get done with one, it's time to buy another one. Right. No, that's a good looking car. I love that. Oh, that's right too. You did that. Yeah. But See, that's where it started at. It's it. all coming back to me. That's not real carbon fiber, but buddy, it looks like real carbon fiber. Yeah, we were not. I'm not gonna tell you how Todd got that. If you need one of those for your car, get with Todd. He'll get you one. Right. right. We're not telling him exactly how all that went down, but trust me. Man, that is cool. Look at the carbon fiber on the gear shift. And that dual gate shifter, I love that, man. I'm just, you know what I'm saying? I see so many pro touring Camaros, and there's a lot of cool ones out there, but it takes a lot of car to just get me to lose my mind about one, and I just like this car. I like what he did. Look how he mounted the subs in the back. It's just so clean, and, you know, there's a little light that comes on back there and makes that glow. Oh, man. Todd, you rocked it, brother. Yeah. Keep building cars. You got anything else going? I've got a, a 70 yeah. trail right now that I haven't started on. Right. Man, look at how close that is, how tight. Man, just a nice job. Yeah. Are they on? I haven't really oh, yeah. got started with the... It really needs to be dark. Yeah, 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 but I think we get to a drift. But I think that's, you know, if I, the next one will be that 70 Chevelle. Okay, cool. Wouldn't you think that'll be done? Man, I'm not really sure, to be honest with you. See, that's the problem with me, is that once I see a project, I want to know when the next project's going to yeah. be done. I'm hard on y'all. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We've seen this one. When's the next one? Todd, you rocked it, brother. You got a really nice 69 Camaro. Thanks so much. Thank hey, you. hey, just before we go real quick, give us that contact information if they want to get something in hydro okay. It's uh, 601-590-2242. And just uh, just let them know that they've seen it, you know, from the video. Right. Let me know what they, you know. Right. And I can give them a little discount on that. That's right. So just so. tell them when you call that you've seen the video on Scotty DTV and you want the Scotty DTV discount, Todd will hook you up. Folks, there you go. That's one really nice Pro Touring 69 Camaro from the Pigeon Forge Ride Run 2013. Hope you all have enjoyed it. See you.